Greetings, it is I, Shepard Chong, bringing to you another episode of A Guide to Avaricia. And today we are looking at another add-on mod. This one is called AOBD Singularities, and it's by RCX Crafter. Now you can probably tell what this one is about from the name of the mod. Um, if you're familiar with uh, modded Minecraft, AOBD stands for Another One Bites the Dust. It's a mod by Ganymedes01, I'm pretty sure it is. Uh, the current uh, name they're using. Yeah, I think so. Um, it's basically a mod that lets you use pretty much any kind of ore in, in pretty much any kind of machine. Not the best explanation I could give, yeah. But yeah, that's basically what it does. It makes um, ores compatible from various mods with other mods, basically. So what does this do? Well, first off, before I go any further, before I forget the chance to say this, this mod is dependent on AOBD. If you're not using AOBD, you can't use this mod. It just does not work. So, what does it do? It takes the stuff AOBD creates, um, it turns ores into dusts, and those dusts can be processed through various machines to create ingots, usually more than just normal Minecraft smelting. And in this case, that is what this does, except instead of just creating ingots for things, it turns anything that, um, well, I say anything, almost anything that AOBD interacts with into a singularity for Avaricia. Now, why did I just say almost anything? Well, if I do this, let's start taking a look at some stuff. Now, of course, with the way item frames work and stuff, you can't see what these items are in the frames, but that's okay. So let's look at some of the stuff you can do with these. Uh, what's in this neutronium compressor? Draconium blocks. Again, if you really know your mods, this is from Draconic Evolution. Again, uh, draconium is not an easy stuff material to get, and it's neat. So that's something you can use. Cool, right? Block of Abyssal Knight. Oh, I know where that's from. That's from Abyssal Craft. Of course, if you really know your Abyssal Craft, you'll know that there's a little bit of a question with that. But anyway, let's move on. Again, Block of Refined Corallium. That's also from Abyssal Craft. And again, question it. Well, what's this? This block here isn't being turned into a... Uh, uh, <laughs> the singularity <laughs> brain fart there this is hepatazi hep hepatizon from metallurgy 4 so this is a block it has like dust and stuff why doesn't it turn into a singularity if everything that aobd interacts with can turn into this stuff with this mod and what about this one damascus steel that doesn't work either so the explanation for this one is actually pretty cool. Uh, basically, uh, this mod does not interact with absolutely everything that AOBD interacts with. So what exactly does that mean? Well, here, I'll give you some examples here in this chest. So hey, this is draconium. Draconium has dust, it has an ingots, and thanks to AOBD, it has this Thaumcraft interaction to create a native Draconium cluster, and thanks to AOBD Singularities, it has a Draconium Singularity. Right? Cool. Basic interaction with the this, this, way this mod works, and the way uh, AOBD works. Now here's where it gets interesting. Abyssal Knight Ore. Abyssal Knight Ingot. Native Abyssal Knight Cluster. For, again, for Thaumcraft interaction with another one by the dust. And Abyssal Knight Singularity. Now you notice that there um, wasn't a dust version there. So again, if you really know your mods, uh, Abyssal Craft does not normally interact with AOBD. You have to use um, Abyssal Craft Integration. That's an add-on mod for Abyssal Craft that specifically allows it to work with other mods in a way that normal just Abyssal Craft doesn't. And yeah, it adds um, uh, a dust version of Abyssal Knight and the Refined Corallium. 
but it does not exist just through straight interaction with without it. So there is no version of the Abyssal Knight Dust or the Corallium Dust, which is what would uh, be how this mod would interact with it, is what you would m might think. So basically, this mod does not actually work based on dust. Which again, another one bites the dust, that's probably what you would think it works. It's actually based around the ingots. Yeah. But it is also based around ore. So, you remember that Damascus steel that was in there? There's blocks of Damascus steel, there's Damascus steel ingots, and there's Damascus steel dust. But because a Damascus steel is an alloy and it has no ore, it does not have a singularity through this mod. Now what about over here? This is Thongcraft stuff. Cinnabar ore. It's an ore. It has this stuff, which is just through the normal mod. You notice that there is no version of dust for it, and it also isn't actually an ingot. It's this. So it doesn't interact with it. And again, you've got stuff like this, the entropy infused stone, which create the shards. That doesn't interact with it. Again, there's another type of stone. And what about these? These are ingots from the mod, thaumium and void metal, but they don't have an ore version, and they don't have a dust version. So they don't turn into singularities. And it's night at the moment. I'm going to change it back to day real quick. And I think that's actually just about everything with this mod. Oh, uh, before I do leave all this stuff, before I finish this up, I'll show you what the... Um, the recipe uh, for the Infinity Catalyst looks like with all these singularities. And usage. There we go. Wow, that's a lot of items. And you will note, well, I say you'll note, if you really know your mods, you notice that some of these things don't have um, special interactions with the specific mod. See, this is Botania. Yeah, and Botania doesn't actually add any ores, even though there are metals to it. So it doesn't actually interact with this mod. Which is pretty cool, honestly. But yeah, so basically the more mods you have that can interact with AOBD, the more items, the more singularity items, it will add to the Infinity Catalyst recipe. Now, it's blocking the view there. How many Infinity Catalysts does this make? Just one. Yep. All these items just for one of these. Hard stuff. <laughs> yeah. So, to wrap the ma this uh, little add-on spotlight up, I suppose. AOB singularities. It requires AOBD. But it does not interact with everything that AOBD interacts with. It can interact with lots of things that AOBD does, but it isn't always guaranteed. So yeah, I'm Shepard Shang, and this is AOBD Singularities by RCX Crafter. Goodbye.